Okay. Has Israel already decided the time and the manner of the response to Iran? The Israeli government uh, has already decided what to do. We know precisely the Iranian capabilities and we know how to deter uh, this terrorist uh, regime. We believe that 70 or 80 percent of the Iranian people are against the regime uh, in Iran. We are going to uh, ensure that this Iranian regime is no longer able to challenge, to uh, threaten this country with nuclear weapons which it seeks. Uh, but also, we want to enable uh, the uh, Iranian people to be able to look for a better future for themselves in Iran. Some officials from the United States claim that Israel will target military and energy infrastructures in Iran, but not nuclear facilities. Do you confirm? The U.S. and Israel have been side by side uh, in this war, shoulder to shoulder. We have tremendous links at every single level between our two governments uh, and people. But ultimately, it is a responsibility of Israel's government to defend itself. Iran say very openly that they wish to destroy this country, that they wish to acquire nuclear weapons to threaten this country, and no country on earth would put up with that threat. It's the only country in the United Nations that openly says it wishes to destroy another country. But I'll tell you, that is not going to happen. This country will, def will defend itself uh, in every way, both in ways, as the Prime Minister has said, both in ways that you have seen and in ways which you have not seen yet. Do you think that Israel will have the military support from the United States for their retaliation against Iran? We uh, have excellent relationships with our partners in the U.S. They go back for decades. They're at every single level uh, of government. And yes, of course, we listen very carefully to our U.S. partners. Uh, but ultimately, it's Israel's responsibility to defend itself and no one else. Uh, we don't ask for any American boots on the ground. We don't ask for any other country to put boots on the ground. Our people are able to defend itself. Our IDF is able to defend itself, and that's precisely what we're going to do.